In this video, we provide the solution to question number three for practice exam number three for Math 1030, in which case we're given a voting preference schedule like so, and we're asked to determine who is the winner of this election using the board account. So the board account gives players points, I should say candidates points based upon their ranking. Um, now, since we only have to determine the winner, we can either use the traditional board account, which I give four points for first place, three points for second place, etc. Or I can use the, the, the reduced board account, where I'm only going to give three points for first player, uh, two points for the second, one point for the third, and then zero for the fourth. I like that one because we have a zero, then I don't have to worry about um, the last place votes there. And so let's try to do some calculations here. Let's first think about A for a moment. Okay, so A has 25 first place votes. So three times 25 is 75, like so. Then player, uh, let's see, candidate two, excuse me, candidate A is gonna have 40 second place votes. So you're gonna get a 40 times, in this case, two. So that gives you 80 points. And then player, or candidate A has 20 uh, for third place votes. So that's worth 20 points right there. So this gives uh, candidate one 175 points, all right? Uh, candidate B, similar type of thing. Uh, B is in first place 20 times, so we times that by three, and we're gonna end up with 60. And then how about second place? Oh, candidate B is never in second place. How about third place? Uh, candidate B shows up there 40 times, so that gives 100 points. We only have to find the winner, so it's not B. We know that. Um, how about C here? So to do C, C is in first place 10 times, so that's going to be worth 30 points. Um, candidate C is in second place. We get here and here. So that happens 30 times. We times that by two. You're going to get 60. And then how about in third place? That happens 25 times, like so. Um, 30 plus 60 is 90, plus 25 gives 115. Um, and so that is much less than A. So C is not the winner. Uh, so let's last now do D here. So D is in first place 40 times, times that by three is gonna give you 120 points. I notice that's more than C has and B has total, right? Um, how about second place? D is in second place um, 25 times, that gives another 50 points. And then D is in, notice right now, 120 plus 50 is 170. It's really close to A, but this will de determine it. If you look at then the third option, uh, third place, D was in there 10 times. So that gives us 180 when we're done. So only barely did player two, candidate two, I should say, beat A, but sure enough, they have the highest score. Even if it's only by five points, you know, a W is a W. And so we see that candidate D is the winner using the board account.